just got some good news. Can I share? This pond that we're fishing, we have two ponds we're fishing today. The one, he said, are virgin fish. have never been fished for before. <laughs> so they're gonna be so stupid. <laughs> Snot just came flying out of Alex's nose. What is that? It is gonna be a sweet day. I'm gonna show you guys a little behind the scenes on how slow motion works. Kind of teach you guys a little bit about that. We're gonna try to capture the sauciest, spiciest, top water, 240 frame per second, blow ups you've seen with Big Bear Mondays, with boogers. this guy. And he's got boogers coming out of his nose. But we'll focus on the lure, not his nose. What are you throwing, Alex? So I'm using my seven two foot travel rod today. Throwing 80 pound braid to a 100 pound leader. Is that overkill? Yes, but Tap says I won't have to retie them. I'm throwing just this little poppin' bug, popper. Chug bug. No. Are you sponsored by Chug Bugs? Yes, I love Chug Bugs. Really? This is a popper. No brand popper. Skitter pop? No brand popper. Then we're using 80 pound braid. And we're going. Don't, no, no, whoa, whoa. Uh, okay, well, we won't get this one in slow mo. We'll get it in 24 frames per second. Just gonna watch this. <laughs> okay, we're moving pods. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna show you guys what I'm gonna use. I'm using my FS5. This is my favorite camera for the higher end stuff for the slow motion. This is 240 frames per second. Um, and I'm gonna pair it with my 7200 Canon 2.8 to give us some range and get right zoomed in on that lure. If that makes any sense, we're trying to capture some top water blow ups. And we're going over to this side of the pond. This is the cast, guys. I'm calling it. I'm calling it right now. Ox's first bear Monday in 240 frames per second. Insert footage now. Jay, are you kidding me? Did you get that? Yeah. We got it. I Slow love motion, my doing all bunch of sorts of tricks. This one isn't jumping. That's okay. Oh, oh baby, the first bear Monday of the trip. And there she is, the first bear Monday of the trip. This is a crazy Australian native fish. And it's kind of like a bass in the sense that it will just destroy top water. But they can get up to 20 pounds. And this is just a little guy. There's that beautiful fish. Just gorgeous, crazy looking mouth and just super aggressive. And we captured all that in 240 frames on top water. Now we need about 10 more and we're done. That was insane. Oh my gosh. That, that was, was good. Crazy. That was really good. And there we go. That is Bear Monday number two. That one ate it probably at my feet, like a foot away. You got it, Jay? That was insane. Yeah, that was like, good. Good. That, was, that was real good. Jay got it. Um, another nice one, probably about three pounds, four pounds. Just a, a little guy, but they fight super hard. That was good. That was good, boys. I was just about to say that there was one trail in it. We are getting some epic that footy. That was good. Look at that gorgeous fish. That's my biggest bear money ever. My third fish of the day just smoked it five feet from shore. We got all that with the slow-mo camp. So we're getting there. We're getting the stuff we need. And uh, this is going to be a really cool video once you guys see like everything come together with it. Just the slow motion and all of the high editing stuff we're going to do. Boom. Um, Coming uh, together. Is this easy? Does he work for the pond? <laughs> yeah, I think he's so. kind of showed up. <laughs> yeah. This is our new buddy. Um, he kind of just showed up and he's going to help us, I guess, release the fish and uh, unhook him. Thank you. He doesn't speak English, so he doesn't know what I'm saying. Are you going to take a cast? Just one. 
Okay. You got the slow-mo cam? Yeah. You know what, I'm gonna tell you shades are important when you're fishing top water because these baits will come flying. It's good, things are, things are uh, happening. We got three slow-mo shots I'm happy with. Nothing, like not perfect yet. I wanna get that eat and then the cartwheel. That's what we're going for. I mean, maybe Alex will capture it. How do you feel about your focus? Your F stop. Your shutter speed. Pop it like you want it. Yeah. Oh! <laughs> that take was ridiculous. <laughs> I hope you're getting this out. <laughs> Did you get any of that? I have way too long to stop it. But I got a sick shot. Here we go. First, Bear Mundy, I would say probably six pounds, maybe seven. Are you rolling? So I can drop a little, a little info to the viewers. So what I'm doing right now with my slow motion is this camera, without any accessories, it can record eight second bursts of 240 frames per second. So what that means is typical video is 24 frames per second. A lot of the YouTube vloggers will film in 60 frames per second. If you shoot in 60 frames per second and you watch it in 24 frames per second, you have a bunch of extra frames. So what that means is you can slow it down. And that's how you get slow motion. So when you get slow motion, you have more frames than you actually need, and then you can spread it all out. So I think about this camera, so it's 240 frames per second. So that's 10 times as fast if you're watching in 24 frames per second. When I film in 240 frames per second, and I edit in 24 frames per second, I can slow down to 10%, which is what's giving us that sexy, sexy slow-mo. Does that make sense? That made sense to me, Jay. Thanks, Alex. No problem, Mr. Stevens. Did not like oh, oh, oh! Yeah, yeah, yeah. These fish are fine on the poppers. This guy's bending my hooks back. We got our hooks bent out bad. Thank you. All right. First bear money on fly. Absolutely crushed the popper. I'll take it. I broke off my popper fly, so... Perrick's gonna go grab me another fly, and I picked up his rod. See if we can get one so Jake can get some more epic, epic slow mo. As you guys saw, we had some amazing topwater action. They're pretty tough to land. They were straightening hooks and, and stuff like that. We all kind of passed around the slow-mo cam, got some very cool jumps and strikes. Um, I think we're gonna take a little break on that pond. And that's gonna be it for this video. Is that it? If that's it for this one. <laughs> we, we might go back and might add some shots into it. But for now, new pond, new video. Thanks for watching. Make sure you're following AP Bass and Sam Sobiak. BKK Fishing Guide, Wes Davis, all part of making these videos happen. We'll see you later.